assisted Commander Shepard in preventing Cerberus forces from killing the Council. Look, I filled out all the forms you requested and jumped through every hoop. I don't even know where the yield set is, and I'm gonna be... Good to see you're all right, Shepard. Miranda, what's going on? Couldn't meet in person. The Citadel is too dangerous right now. I heard about the attempted coup. Yeah, with Kai Lang's help, Udina nearly seized control. Kai Lang? That slippery bastard's still alive? He's alive and right in the middle of all this. That complicates things. I'll be on my guard. Look, I don't have much time, but I learned what happened to my sister. Where is she? I don't know that yet, but my father was definitely responsible. If he's done anything to her, I'll kill him. Miranda. Shepard, listen. I'm being hunted by Cerberus assassins, a lot of them. I need to stay out of sight. What? Why? I heard a rumor, maybe more, that my father is working on something for the elusive man. Something big. Why would your father be working with the elusive man, especially now? My father is ruthless about preserving his legacy. Legacy? He has an obsession with making his mark in history, ensuring his dynasty lasts forever. And you think the elusive man made him an offer? Exactly. Whatever's going on with your father can't be good. We have to figure this out. I agree, but I need to do this myself. It's time I stopped running from him. You're sure? Yes. I can't think straight until I know Ari is safe. Be careful. I can't promise that, Shepard. Could you? No. I couldn't.
I hoped you'd come. I won't remain here much longer. What are you doing on the Citadel, Samara? I suppose I came to say goodbye. Faler is safe, and Rila is at rest. I felt the need to speak to you before heading to battle. I want you to know there is no one else I'd rather see leading us in our last hours. We'll make the galaxy proud. The largest fleet in history is already on our side. It is impressive. Most would have deemed such an alliance impossible. But Shepard, be sure to assess your force's strengths and weaknesses before setting out. What are the other Justicars doing for the war? Most have made it home. They will attempt to hold Thessia. With the odds we face, it's possible our order will no longer exist after this war. There's that few of you? Our numbers were never great. We must prepare to sacrifice ourselves, if that is what's required. Was being a Justicar worth it, if that's how it all ends? The Justicars were formed to bring order to a world that laughs at the notion. The role is solitary. Its demands are lonely and uncompromising, often to the point of pain. But following the code left me with no regrets. Take that for what you will. You know, I never asked you if your code has anything useful on fighting Reapers. Treat them as any other enemy. Show no quarter, mercy, or weakness. The only difference is the scale of our foe. The code is too strict to account for such small discrepancies. Is that how you see it too? You yourself killed a Reaper on the Citadel, and then another on Tachanka. I can only follow such bravery. Will Falaire be all right in the monastery? Or what's left of it? We spoke for some time. It won't be easy. But if there is a way to survive, Falaire will fight it. It was... good to see her again. Perhaps it's unseemly for a Justicar to dwell so much on her family. I'm just happy things worked out. I was fortunate that Falaire saw things so clearly. And it would have turned out quite differently without your intervention. Thank you. Good luck out there, Samara. You as well. I don't know if you believe in such things. But Goddess go with you, Shepard. We'll both be tested in fire, soon enough. Reaper forces continue their assault on Asari space, claiming the Nimbus Cluster and the Selenian Nebula. Was the Volus Ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. with us before, Ambassador. That's because you were actually doing some good in the galaxy before. Has that changed? How many colonies would be gone if we hadn't taken action against the Collectors? Too many. But fighting the Alliance... ...must continue in order to end the war. We understand it took a lot for you to reach out to Cerberus, Ambassador Korlak. We ask that you trust us a little longer. People are monsters! Ambassador, please. Hundreds dead. Udina betraying the Council. I should have cut ties with you ages ago. And what will that accomplish now? The risks you took by passing information to Cerberus... It left you in an interesting position. If you sever contact, we can't protect you from the consequences. I don't... I have no time for this. We'll speak again. Have a good day, Ambassador Korlak. 
The Turians think I'm still working for Cerberus. They've put a price on my head. I can't go to CSEC, but Cerberus has plans. An entire Turian colony rests on my life. If anyone finds this, I hid a tracking receiver in the office suite beside the human embassies. Ambassador, can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Take it easy on him. Has to be alive till the credits come through. Tell me where you are. Uh, we're still near the Presidium. CSEC will check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. Sure. Once they notice you're missing. Stay calm. Help's coming. I need more info on your location. I... I don't know what else I can give you. So did you talk you trying to bribe us? No, please, if you kill me, a colony will be wiped out. You should have tried the bribe. Damn, wrong door. are the only race that can fight on the toxic world, so they need support. Well, ideally, something like a cactinosaur. They're good in mountains, immune Credits to toxins, went through. Do it. loyal to their riders. No, wait! Wait! Fortunately, they were driven to extinction during the Ragnar War. So, unless we can engineer something new, broken on toxic world, we'll have to fight on foot without support. Commander Shepard, do you have a minute? Thank you. 